Our last programme this afternoon for schools and colleges takes us to the Music Arcade for Music and Dance. That's here on BBC One in two and a half minutes. composer Aaron Copeland took the tune of that song, changed it a bit and used it for one of the dances called Saturday Night Waltz from his ballet music rodeo. First, listen to the tune of Old Paint played on the oboe.
And this is Copeland's version of that tune. Listen out for that tune on the oboe as the London Youth Symphonietta plays Saturday Night Waltz. was only one of the dances that the cowboys and their ladies danced on a Saturday night at the ranch house. They also had some livelier dances. Copeland wrote some music called Hoedown, which uses this square dance tune. As this is music for dancing, we decided to have a brand new dance created to go with the music. So we asked the London Festival Ballet to help us out. And please, knees well back over the little toes. Follow the arm with your head slowly down. These dancers are all members of the ballet company. Knees well back, fine. All right, now let's... John is the ballet master, and he'll be helping to teach the new dance to the four dancers. Anne, who comes from Australia. Kevin, from Nottingham. Jackie, from Norwich. And Colin, from Morecambe in Lancashire. All right, Barbara, have we got something for that? Fifth position, introduction, arms... At the moment, the dancers are taking their daily class. 
doing exercises at the bar to warm up their muscles ready for the rehearsal. To the side. To the back. Now throw up to the side. Up, turn in, turn out from the back. Up, good, and relax the arm. Fine, yes. into the center and we'll take our pirouette exercise. In the center of the room, the dancers can do more difficult exercises without the support of the bar. After this, they'll be ready to start rehearsing the dance. And... Uh... Michael is the choreographer. He's created the new dance, which means he's decided how many dancers to use and what steps and movements they'll do. The first thing I had to do was get to know the music very, very well and then create the steps with the dancers. After that, we could then go on and create some nice things. I'm hoping to use eight children as well as the four dancers I already have so that they can join in the dancing and create a party atmosphere. We're now going to rehearse a difficult part of the ballet, which they haven't quite got right yet. Barbara, and... Stop. <laughs> Don't hold everything. Yeah. Are you okay? <laughs> all right, you're both all right? Not yeah. injured? No. I think you're still holding her far too close to you, yeah? If you can just let her get away from you, throw her away from you. Keep your hand rather than back. I mean, yeah. I think you're just getting far too close here. Yeah. If you could just take her more in the center of the back, yeah? Mm -hmm. And then let her push off your shoulder rather than holding her tightly in. Just throw her away. Yeah. Treat her like a bag of coal or something. Just chuck her. That's it, yeah. I think what you did, you allowed yourself to go around with her, pulled around something, you fell over. That was fine, that's good, yeah. We could do it again. Yeah. yeah. Okay, fine, yeah. Yeah, let's take it Works again. Better. Same place, yeah, come yeah. On. Let's go back to the same place then, yeah. And... Three. Keep your arm right down, come forward, keep it low, yeah. The dancers won't meet the orchestra until the final rehearsal. Instead, a pianist plays the music. Good, good, yeah. Okay, go. Ah, okay. Try and get the leg together, girls. One, two, three, four. Yeah, you have to wait a fraction for Kevin. Jump, jump, jump. Yeah. Boom, boom. Now here I'd like you to try and jump as far as you can into his arms so we make it look as like, exciting as possible. Further away. Yes? Oh. Okay. Yeah? One step away, turn back. Yes, like that, exactly, yeah? So he's more stuck. Let's try some music. All right, Barbara? Yeah, same place. rehearsed the music. They had their final rehearsal a few days ago and now they're all here in the studio with eight children from Marlborough School to perform the new dance called Hoedown.
much. Now, John, if I can call you over, I believe you're going to get some of our audience working. Yes, I'd like five volunteers from the audience to come and have a go. Look, I'll tell you what, just make that four, because there's a fellow over there who's been dying to do some dancing all day. I'll go and get him. Just a second. Fine. It's Tim. Tis. Right. Good. <laughs> Never OK. Did it. No. <laughs> Let's have um, the boy in the blue jumper and the boy in the brown jumper there and the little girl in the light blue and the girl in the grey jumper. Right, now, what are your names? What's your name first? Jatin. Jatin and Stephen. Emma. Emma and Eleanor. Eleanor. Good. Right, now, boys, you have a rest for a moment. Let's ask the girls to come over here first. And uh, we're going to do a little bit on the bench here. Have either of you done any dancing before? No, never? This is your first time. So, have a watch. I'm going to ask the, the dancers. Jackie, Annie, the boys, you know the part where you jump off the bench? Got to be very brave to do this, but the boys are very strong. They'll catch you, don't worry. All right, and jump up. Splendid, good, right. It's quite easy, isn't it? Up on the bench and have a go. All right, what about a practice first? Boys, all right, and up. Good, fine, quite easy. Now we'll make it a little bit more difficult. One arm round his neck, all right, and we'll ask the boys to stand a little bit further away. So you really have to jump, put your legs up, all right, on the count of three. One, two, three, jump! That's marvellous, very good, very good. Can we ask the boys now? Come on then. <laughs> and Kevin, if you can stand up on the bench and you know the part where you do the split jump there. Boys, watch this carefully. Marvellous. You ready for this, Tim? Yeah, <laughs> I think you better let him go Jat first. Jat in yeah. first. All right, Jat in, up on the bench. So, Along to the end there, just like being on the high diving board here. Just bend your knees and touch your toes. All right, and good, good, okay. Stephen, it's your go. Just split your legs out and touch your toes on the end, all right? Just bend your knees first and jump. Good boy, that's Very fine. Good. Tim, it's your go. I think I can do it as <laughs> quite as well as he could. All right, <laughs> along to the end down. there. It's a long way down. So all you have to do is just bend your knees and split your legs out. It's easy. Easy, right. nothing to it. And... Well done. Well Marvelous. done, Tim. We're going to have to get you an audition for the Festival Ballet. Well, thanks, John, and thanks, everyone. Well, to finish off this week, join in and sing the cowboy song, Whoopi Tai Yo. Yo. Tie, I am. 